laps and most entertaining cup tie from the stands. What was it like to play in? Uh, yeah, overriding feelings, obviously frustra frustration, not coming out, getting into the next round. But yeah, the atmosphere was good. So yeah, can't ask much more. You created a hatful of chances. Yeah, we did have enough chances. That's probably why a bit of frustration we feel. We probably created enough to win that game, but it is what it is and just focus on the league Saturday. Including one from you, you smashed the bar. Yeah, just come at me quick. Uh, it's bobbly, so my initial thought was just keep it down and it sort of just rode up a bit. Didn't want to hit it that high, but yeah, could have, could have gone anywhere. <laughs> Were you heartened by the way the boys played? Yeah, definitely, I think, especially second half. Started that second half when the crowd got behind us and we were on the front foot. Uh, I thought we showed that we could more than match them. Yeah, it was a better second half performance than first. What what ignited that? Just I think just front foot. I think we gave them a bit too much respect in the first half. We was uh, letting the 34 get on it uh, quite a bit or letting their centre half spare, whereas in the second half we just went man for man and said to see if they could deal with it. And how do you think you did? Because that's your first start in quite some time since the Forest Green Rovers match, one which you'll <laughs> want to forget. Uh, yeah, obviously... You always feel you can do better, but it's good just to get 90 minutes in the legs. Uh, yeah, good to be out there, get 90 minutes, and yeah, good to be out there with the boys again. How did Derby differ as opposed to League Two opponents? Uh, I think you can see in the first half, it was just they let they let us have it, we let them have it. But I don't think that's our strength, so I think we should have just well, yeah, as we showed in the second half, we went man for man. That's obviously our strengths, and I thought it was a lot better. Some good performances tonight individually from players who we've not seen a lot of. Callum Gordon, Will yeah. Swan, the, the likes of those. Yeah, uh, quality. There's quality. There's quality, quality in that dressing room uh, on the bench. Not even in the squad. Sometimes I think even Gailey was out the squad last last week, and he's a quality player. So yeah, there's there's plenty of quality in the squad. Uh, buzzing to see Kells back out there. I think my first season when. I was out there with Kells, I loved it, so good to see Kells back out there. And yeah, obviously Swanee's got quality. What do you make of the squad that's been put together? Uh, yeah, very good, very competitive, especially in the midfield. There's about, I don't know, you'll tell me, probably six midfielders, I don't know. There's, there's quite a lot of midfielders fighting for, not a lot of places. So yeah, there's good quality in the squad and yeah, just looking forward to the season. Do you relish that challenge of getting into the midfield? Because not many can recall it being as competitive in that area as it is here and now? Uh, yeah, obviously you relish trying to get in the team. I think as long as the team's winning, uh, it is what it is and you've just got to try and play your way into the team. Obviously, when me and Skip come on in the league the other day trying to make an impact, today you get a chance, you've got to try and make an impact. So, yeah, it is what it is and just got to keep trying to fight for that spot. Yeah, just how can you break into it? Just training, I think. Training, obviously... Uh, carries into their game so if you're doing well in training you're more likely than not going to get a chance so yeah I just got to try and keep my head down train right and when I do get my chances try and take them. You just say a lot about the quality of the midfield because a couple of years ago you were for sure and certain the first choice midfielder on the on the team sheet. I, I don't know about that but yeah. Uh, well you won the player of the season awards you sweep them clean a couple of years back. Yeah uh, yeah football changes quick but it is what it is you just got to try and keep your head down and get back in the team. <laughs> Uh, what are your personal aims then uh, during this long season? Should you get in that team on a regular basis, Laps? Just promotion. Just I want to see the club get promoted. That's all I want. I'm in my last year here now, so I wouldn't deem it as a successful time at the club if there wasn't a promotion with it. Still enjoying it? Yeah, still enjoying it, yeah. <laughs> well done tonight. Cheers, Steve. Thank you.